Right, so it is currently, I think it's like two in the morning, maybe even three now. Basically, Geordie, my crypto friend who I was in Tenerife with, has given me a shout for a meme coin that he uh, is aware of or that he's friends with the, the owner or something like that. Anyways, he told me, Rob, this is a good little opportunity you've got here. So I put, I think, about 1.5k in. Just kind of like, I don't, I don't really expect much from it, to be honest, because I'm already a bit down on the old meme coins. Bit of a gamble. But this one looks like it's playing out well. It's currently 2.30 in the morning, so kind of want to go to bed, but know that I need to cash this out at some point and don't want to cash out too early because at the minute, I think it's about 180% up. So pretty much up to around 3.5, almost 4K, I think, at the high. And we'll see, obviously, what it gets to overall. Uh, that's my balance and net profit or net balance so that's great i'm currently watching the side men probably can't see that um because i am that generation what else have i done oh i just just requested my hg payout and they said that was fine so yeah uh it was 4k overall but obviously their profit splits is only about 3.2 realistically but then the refund as well which i'm just going to get another challenge with so it doesn't hit my bank but yeah this is me being a degenerate and trading meme coins in the morning all right, so it's getting even fucking weirder. It's on like 600% up and I've only taken out like not that much. So yeah, good start to the week, I guess. It's like almost on 7K. It's fucking crypto shit. It's ridiculous. Um, yeah, shout out Jordy. Appreciate that, mate. We'll give you, um, we'll buy your coffee or something. <laughs> Just to show you the time, by the way. Pretty good. <laughs> Okay, so we are going to work. When I say work, I mean to the office, not a corporate job. Uh, I look really shit at the moment. I've decided to hibernate a little bit, so I've not had a trim for a little while since coming back from Tenerife. I've just been locked in. Currently in a trade at the minute, that's doing ridiculously well. Um, I've done like a little challenge for myself in terms of like basically an account flip. I've not done one in ages. It's not how I would normally trade and it's not how I'd recommend to trade. If you've got the money to trade with big accounts, I would do it with big accounts or I'd do it with funding. But I've got a lot of people at the moment saying like, oh my God, what happens if funding isn't a thing? Um, and like, you can absolutely do it without funding. I did it without funding. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I very much went full time as a Forex trader before I got funded in the first place. So, if I'm going full-time at 19... Fuck off! Yeah, if I'm going full-time at 19 without being funded with anything, then surely that means that you can be a trader without getting funded. And um, that is the case. Now, I get very... I didn't get very lucky. I've been very lucky with account flips prior to me going full-time. did mean that I had a good amount of money to go full-time with. But today... I'm kind of showing that you can do it with literally, I mean, it's not how you should do it. Like it's very much an aggressive style of trading. Um, it's actually not the worst managed risk. We've just had very tight stop losses um, and two very good trades, but I haven't traded for about a week and a half. So I've been waiting for these kind of positions for a long time. Uh, a bad thing to do is basically just like trade like I am now, but all the time and wait for really low quality setups. That's not what you should do. But yeah, I'm gonna break down kind of like how the positions are going, where we've gotten to. The aim is to get 2K all the way up to 10K within hopefully this one week. I've obviously took a trade Monday and then I've held that for a really long way to the basically structural highs on the four hourly. So yeah, really looking good. I think at the moment we are about six or 7K from 2K. So really nice trade, really can't be upset with it. 
but we've got to wait obviously for more confirmation hopefully there's another setup late in the week that might push us over to that 10k mark if we do then really cool video and hopefully that shows you guys that you can do it without being funded this doesn't mean that you should do it like this i would definitely recommend doing it with a funded account instead this is like the most aggressive account flip it's, it's, this is not money that i care about this money that i'm just throwing into an account for just for shits and giggles it's literally for this one video so if you're wondering if this is how i trade at all times it's absolutely not it's just for me to show you guys that this is basically possible uh, and very much a thing you're too sweet for me i'll take my whiskey Right, so in between me trading that personal account, I managed to get it up to just shy of 10K. I think actually it might have hit 10K and then I didn't close the trade. Uh, so I went back down to 8K, which is a bit annoying. Uh, we have got an update for you though in the next video on where that 2K account has gotten to within three days. So very exciting stuff. So yeah, basically I switched from my personal to my funded account, which I'm gonna talk through right this second. Okay, so as you can see, we are about 9k up on this trade now uh, majority of it is well majority about half of it's going to close out what well, is closed out and i'm probably about to close out the rest of it just to show it's my acg account there you go this is the actual position i've obviously streamed it all live well filmed it all live when i was taking it so i'm going to share that with you guys now but um yeah really really good day really good week that was a previous trade as well so cannot be upset This is how I feel I'm cold and out in street Lying naked on the floor So taking out 20 lots in my 40 lot position One around here on the hourly order block And one, I don't know, one I think around here um, But the second one around here Yeah, hoping for this to be broken If it is, I'm holding for a little while Because we've swept a lot of liquidity now um, If we push past this low Then we are getting that change of character on the hourly now as well so there's no reason to not hold it for longer. Probably one that I hold for a little bit. The only thing I'm worried about is ACG's rules. This payout will probably be quite big. It's already 7K by the looks of it. So um, yeah, it's a, it's a rough one if it, if it goes all the way to, like, I don't know, even down here potentially. So yeah, we'll see how it goes. Right, I don't normally show this because um, I don't want to, but here's my payout for Alpha Capital Group. I'll just show you because obviously this is a YouTube video documenting it all. Um, I would have done the same with my forex funds, but they didn't let me. Um, they didn't let me get obviously paid out at that time, and obviously they went under. So that was the end of that. But just to show you, this is my only account. Um, if you look at the dashboard, you've got all accounts. You've got first one. This is the, the only challenge I've ever done. Two hundred k challenge passed. Phase two passed. First payout. Obviously they took their splits. So that's why it's not four point one k. And then if you look here, we're back up to around $8,643. Up, closed out 4K, 4.5K, Jesus, running at the moment. So hopefully, wait another 14 days, and that'll be circa $12,000, $13,000 made in just 28 days, one month, bi-weekly payouts. So yeah, very good, very nice. Um, my, yeah, feel quite bad for ECG though, because I've only done one challenge with them, and I've I'm rinsing them currently. So yeah, game's a game though. Uh, whilst they're here, we want to make as, as much from them as possible. Uh, but yeah, th that is, that's pretty much it. This is the proof that it's all like actually on a funded account and not just MT4 screenshots and whatnot. And everyone was like, why did you say that was so bad? And I was like, because I was a meme coin. <laughs> yeah. And they were like, oh. They Right, what a day it has been insane to be honest. Probably one of my best trading days, full stop. There's a private jet landing. Soon come with this payout. No, not that big. But yeah, literally been paid out from HG today. Pretty small payout, about 3.6, something like that, 3.2 maybe. But we're currently still in the trade, but 8.5 slash 6k up. We've taken out $4,000 today because that was the payout and we've already closed out quite a bit and that's just to prove it's funded. So 
very good day as well as trading the personal and doing a little bit of a flip end up being just shy of 10k which is a bit annoying because that trade massively reversed so about 8.5 which game's a game you can't win them all but yeah ended up get, catching the reversal on this one uh, instead so yeah been a really good day and um sam's just really cute i think we might potentially be going to dubai next week potentially there's a small chance there especially with these payouts giving us a bit of spending money so um yeah Oh, also crypto in the start of this vloggy thing, Geordie gave me a shout on a meme coin and that did, it was at 1.1.1k percentage up. So 1,100% up, which is ridiculous. Bear in mind my account flipped from 2k to 10k was 500%. That did double that. So I think, I can't remember how much I put in, I put about five sol and it went up to like, I think it was 50 a bit past 50 but i ended up only cashing about 30 and then it came all the, all the way back down so pretty crazy how much percentage is that five to sold to th five to 30 600 600 percent return in over overnight so i think that's worth about six grand something like that so that was good that was made overnight but it did fuck up the rest of my week because i was extremely tired there's a private jet taking off have a, have a look at that just behind the tree where is it? Mr. Blue Jets landed. Oh, wow, really? It's quite a cool one, isn't it? Quite a big fan of that, actually. I'd actually consider that quite cool, I would. Right, we're going back inside. Now, I want to say that this is not how trading should be. This is very aggressive trading. I haven't traded for two weeks before doing this. So the funded account, all of that stuff, even that was really aggressive. And then my personal account, you should not really try and flip accounts. It's just to show that it is possible without funding. You can have an actual strategy doing it. So whether that's 2% risk per position, 5% risk per position, 10% risk per position, but you're happy to lose that and you're going to make it get to a certain target potentially and then maybe step off the risk, bring it back down to five, two, one. That's kind of how I used to do it when I used to flip accounts a lot. This one is literally just money that I do not care about. That two grand is just for entertainment purposes only. So it was just to see if I could do it again, um, which it has. So yeah, there's gonna be a part two to it next week. I'm probably gonna lose it all at some point. So just a heads up, that'll be a video as well. And I'll try and keep you all up to date with exactly how it goes. Part of me does wanna cash it out now, but we'll see if we do do that in the next video. Subscribe, subscribe to me, subscribe to me and follow my both my socials. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you.